Good morning, 7 a.m. We've got 20 miles ahead of us. Let's go. Before we get to the topic of today's video, let me say a few words about the run which will provide our backdrop. This 20 mile long run took place at Red Top Mountain State Park in Georgia. I actually start just outside the park with an out and back on the Eagle Scout Trail to the summit of Vineyard Mountain where I recently filmed the Vertical Mile Challenge. After returning to my car, I crossed the bridge and covered just about every trail in the park. The 20 mile long run is a staple workout for most marathoners and ultra marathoners. It's a long enough effort to place certain demands on the body without severely breaking down the athlete, especially if done at a speed commiserate with your training level. This distance also will generally deplete glycogen stores and require you to intake hydration and nutrition regularly, which is key to training your gut to continue working through the effort. Now to the topic at hand. In the comments from last week's video, one viewer, Kevin, noticed I was wearing headphones throughout my four hour run and asked what I was listening to. So I thought I'd take the opportunity to share some of my favorite things to listen to while I run. First off, I don't listen to music. This is hard for some to understand, but I'm not really a music person. I don't really listen to much. That's where we started. Bridge is over there. It's kind of like fancy coffee. I really have to be in the mood for it. But generally, I just like hot black coffee. In the same way, I usually prefer to listen to news, podcasts, and audiobooks. But on my runs, I have historically listened mostly to podcasts, though I have recently been introduced to audiobooks and am really enjoying that as well. Let's start with audiobooks, since this is what I have the least experience with. I've been listening to audiobooks for less than two months now, and all I can recommend is checking with your local library to see what app they use to loan out audiobooks. I am using Hoopla and can check out five digital items a month. It's free and it's all done on the app. All I have to do is put in my library card number and I had immediate access. I love to read and have really enjoyed audiobooks on my commute and during my runs. I enjoy both fiction and nonfiction and have been rotating between the two. But on this run you're watching now, I did not listen to any audiobooks because the book I'm currently listening to is not exactly running material. I'm listening to A Brief History of Time by Stephen Hawking, and wow, it is incredibly informative and eye-opening and mind-expanding, but it is dense, and it is full of complex ideas beyond my comprehension. Instead, I opted for my old favorites, a variety of podcasts, and today I'd like to share with you my top five podcasts. We'll start with the two running and fitness related podcasts that I regularly listen to. First, 10 Junk Miles. This is a great show with a few formats. My favorites are gang shows and long runs. The gang show is a bunch of running friends sitting in a basement talking, laughing, drinking, making dirty jokes, and telling stories, running related or not. Topics often stray from running, but these are all normal folks and they all run ultras. And that was what drew me in. I started listening before I ever ran an ultra, before I personally knew any ultra runners. And they were the ones that showed me that it's not just elites that can run 100 miles. I highly recommend 10 Junk Miles, but be aware the content and language is very much uncensored and not safe for work or children. Second is the Tough Girl Podcast. This one is from England and features a lot of incredible athletes and adventures from many different sports around the world. And they just happen to all be women. I also like the host and interviewer for how little she interrupts and she really lets the guests tell their story. My next two favorite podcasts are the ones that make me laugh out loud the most. I'm sure many folks have caught me listening to these, laughing on the trails I run past and must think I'm nuts. These are both NPR game shows. Wait, wait, don't tell me and ask me another. I love both of these and can't hardly get enough. Wait Wait is billed as a news quiz show, while Ask Me Another is a radio puzzle game. Both are absolutely hilarious and mentally engaging, which can help take your mind off the task at hand. Lastly, one that's a little different is Retire Sooner by Wes Moss. Moss is a financial advisor and a veteran financial radio host who has recently begun a podcast. He has some really good practical tips and ideas about retiring sooner, which may be just one year early or decades early. I hope you check out some audiobooks from your library or try one of these podcasts. If you do, let me know what you think, or if you have recommendations, please leave them in the comments below. 
And of course, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. All right, that's gonna wrap it up for me today. Got 25 miles in and 100% humidity. So we stayed on top of electrolytes and hydration. But 20 miles, uh, 2,900 feet of gain, and just hair's breadth shy of five hours. It's a great day on the trails. Don't forget, persistence pays off. Hard work matters. Just keep putting it in, getting it done day after day. And you'll accomplish your goals, guarantee it.